And we are back at Atlanta Hawks Media Day. I am now joined by the vet, the man, the myth, the legend. The whole guy. Vinsanity. <laughs> How's it going? Doing well, man. This you, is you uh, are the man, number, by the way. I'll make sure nobody's around. This is number 21. They're all listening. Oh, yeah. It's 21. <laughs> my mic's on. How does it feel to be at your 21st Media Day? I don't know. I'm, I'm excited like it's my first year. I, I really? Can't, I, I don't know why. Like, uh, I woke up this morning. Uh, woke up extra early. It's like, man, let's go have a good day. I don't know. I, I think when you, I guess you get near the end, you have an appreciation for it. Yes, it's 21, but this could be the last one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I think that's what it is, maybe. And mm, it's weird. It's so it's, it's so a weird feeling. I'm, I'm lost. Yeah, I am. I am. I have a great appreciation for it. Usually, you're like, oh man, it's getting media day over. Oh, now, I was like, all right, what's next? Awesome. <laughs> well, good. We'll keep you here for a while. We already sure. have a lot of questions, but we want to let fans know if you have a question for Vince, send it in on Facebook Live or on Twitter using hashtag AskHawks. We will jump right into it. Let's go. We've talked about this. I just talked to Trey about this. You were drafted before our point guard, Trey Young, was even born. How does that feel for you? Uh, I'm okay with it now. I, I am. Uh, some years back, when I started becoming the old, one of the oldest guys in the league, I was just like, Ugh, man, this is, this is weird. Because I used to make fun of Kevin Willis, obviously. You called him Grandpa, right? I did. Yeah. I did. At least they called me Unc or OG. I can handle that. <laughs> you know, Grandpa, I can't handle. Uh, but uh, I tell you, it's just, it's just a, it's a different situation. But we still have the same mutual respect for each other, and you know, he, he sits right by me in the locker, so we're gonna have to get along. <laughs> <laughs> no options. No option. So Either way. <laughs> coach said at his press conference that when you, we signed you, you called coach and you said, Coach, how can I help? Who can I talk yes. to? Tell me about that and kind of why you felt like that was your responsibility. Uh, I, did, I don't know. I've just taken it as my responsibility just to. You know, I, I know who I am. I know what I bring to the table. Um, you know, I, I know why teams are bringing me on outside of basketball as far as just share my knowledge and help these guys grow and, and, and succeed in, in, in their new positions as, as professional players. So uh, he just says, like, he was like, basically, he's like all everybody. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, that's fine with me. You know, uh, it's a process to where, you know, you go through – training camp you go through these practice sessions and you get to learn the guys and who they are and what they're sensitive about um and so on and so forth and slowly working my way around and it's, it's going to be fun I, I, you know, long as long as the guys are, are willing and open to allowing me to get in their ear and get on the nerves it's going to happen it's going to happen <laughs> one more question for me and then we'll go into the fan questions sure. Training camp starts this week. Mm -hmm. Do you have any specific goals for yourself going into your 21st training camp? Stay healthy and, and, and be a voice, be a leader, and just help these guys figure it out. You know, regardless, like, if this is, at the end of the day, this is still basketball. Uh, it's just the, the, the other nuances of the game that you, they're still trying to figure out, and you're trying to play the game that you've always played all your life. But figure out your new role, accepting your new role, the whole thing, new, new, uh, new city, new opportunity, all of these things play a factor. And, you know, we can just kind of put it into a routine where guys feel comfortable. That's my kind of my job. I mean, I'm a, I'll get through training camp somehow. <laughs> <laughs> so there has Oh, yeah, my job, too. I'm supposed to oh, play yeah. as well. Oh, yeah, you're supposed to that. also play basketball. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> um, I tend to forget that sometimes, by the way. Sorry. Well, it's okay. I won't tell Coach. Um, there has to be something that you do to have made it this far. Like, is there a secret <sighs> green drink, secret workout that you do that's made you? Must you must drink the green drinks then. <laughs> you must know about that. You, you got to try it all, right? Yeah, right, right, right. I got to be looking like you when no, I'm your age. You know what I'm saying? Good luck. Good luck. How, yeah. how have you made it this far? You're still in I, game shape. I tell you what, I, the biggest thing for me is just my willingness to do whatever it takes to be in shape and compete at this level. That's the biggest thing. It's like I have a laundry list of things that I have to do. I shouldn't say laundry list because it's not really dirty. It's all clean. Yeah. So I have a list of things that. To-do list? There you go. So I have this this list that I, I basically it is a to-do list, the things I, I just need to do to prepare myself, and I have to stick to it. And my willingness to do these nine, ten things, sometimes it's, sometimes it's 12 things. It just depends as the year go on. A few more things to do are added. And I feel like he was about to run on my screen. <laughs> these young guys, man, I swear, man. Oh, I knew these, it. Here they go. You're there talking we go. about these there young guys. There, see, here we go. Hold on, guys. Uh, it's going pretty well. This is my first one as a hawk. 
Hey, I was about to say. <laughs> what were you about to say? Watch this. <laughs> Anyways, okay. Have a good one. I didn't want to interrupt. They made me. Okay, but you did. It's all good. Gotcha. Appreciate it. Respect. Like I was saying, so uh, I stick to my. Uh, <laughs> so you gotta be a pro. You gotta keep going. So Look I, at you, I, I basically. Uh, have a list and I stick to it and I'm willing to do it and I think that's the biggest thing so when I tell I could tell somebody say hey here's my list what do you think so if you look at the list you see some things that you like to do it's like oh I can do that but you have to do you them all the to stick them to, to stick to or to to last as long and I think that's what people kind of fall to the wayside so I think I tell a person find what works for you and you have to be willing to do it that's just it's just your willingness and everything else will fall in line we hope <laughs> So we have a lot of fans asking, oh, are up? we going to see Hello, a 360 everybody. dunk this year? Um, can you still do a 360 dunk? I can dunk? still do a 360 dunk. Uh, yeah. In my mind, as, as of right now, yes, I can in still do head, it. Yes. Yeah, come, come, yeah, see, you guys got to understand, I'll probably do it in practice more so, but I can do it. Maybe one of the days I'm feeling real good, if the weather's warm enough, um, I'll, uh, I'll, 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 I'll try it. I can, I can still do a windmill. That's that's still impressive. That's still, yeah. we, can we get one of those in a game? I, I might be able to do that All also. Right. All right. Well, we'll look for I don't know. that. It's, it's all it's all pending. Everything is pending. <laughs> you know, uh, I want to last the whole season. So <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Maybe the last game. Yeah, last game. Yeah. Why not? Um, how does it feel for you coming full circle? This is from Chase. You interviewed Trey at Summer League and now you're his teammate. Uh, how does that feel for you? It's weird. Uh, it, it's it's kind of weird. Just in, in general, because uh, I mean, you know, a lot of these guys. I'm looking around the the, the gym. It's just a lot of these young guys. You, know, you, you pass uh, pass them. I, I remember having a brief altercation. Nothing crazy with RJ last year, and now we're teammates. Yeah. You know, it's just. Yeah. I mean, it's just one of those things. Just, but yeah, I, I just remember walking in the hallway and, and I saw him, and I and I, basically, I, like I, like I did with Coach. I said. I'm willing to talk and, and be an outlet for any of these guys. I told Trey the same thing, not knowing we we're going to be teammates. And I was just like, hey, if you need anything, you need somebody to talk to, feel free. I'm sure you can get a hold of me wherever you are, wherever I am, because I didn't know where I was going to be. And he's like, okay, cool. And so I think some guys feel like, oh, he's just talked. But like, I've done it for years and years and just have guys to reach out to because sometimes in, in reality, I don't care how big your name is, you're going to have rough times whether the, the world sees it or not. And you always want an outlet because I've been there, and you know I've, I was lucky, fortunate enough to have a lot of people that I can call. So I, I try to do that for young guys as well, whether they know me or not. And last question: Is there one rookie in particular that you feel like you'll be mentoring this season? Um, I, I, not one. It's, it's really not. I, I try to make it my business to kind of help everybody in, at different 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 times of the year uh, because everybody's not going to uh, is going to go through a different. Um, or have a diff different situation that's really affecting them at different points of the year. You know? So whether they're having the success or, or not having success, uh, their expectations they haven't reached and they're reading what's said about them, that's the biggest thing. Mm -hmm. you know? My thing is I tell guys, hey, stay off social media, man. Or if you're going to be on it, you can't be sensitive. You know, I think people behind, you know, behind their computers and phones sometimes just talk just to talk. And we, we let that affect mm -hmm. them and we, we act out or we let it get to us. So that's just my job. I, I just want to be Mr. Mentor to everyone, <laughs> if I can. All right. Well, that is a wrap, Vince. That's thank it? you so Come much. On, what else I know. We, we got to let you go. To, we got to okay. let you go I to your other right. stations. The people need that's to talk to you. That's yeah, right. it's media day. <laughs> Vince, thank you so much. Vince Sanity, half man, half amazing. We got so it all. So and cool. we are so happy to have you here. Thank you. You'll be seeing a lot more of this guy this yeah. season. Vince? I'll be around. And we have Kent Bazemore and John Collins up next. Don't forget to submit your questions. We'll be back.